All right, Critical Mass. Underdog is in the house. Critical Mass, Underdog. Uh, October 9th, 2012. I always look at my thing. I keep on feel like I forget the date. Folks, I give you today a erroneous... Um, erroneous Twitter tag. Because today, I, I got it. I am now Critical Master on Twitter. Critical Master. Two S's. I'll put it in my thing today. Gumbo Chef deserves all the credit for it. I'm not taking any credit. You know, I, I was thinking of a name for, uh, I was thinking of, of a name for my, uh, you know, and he said, why, why 17? And I was like, you know, I don't know. I just said it was one that I came up with. And, uh, lo and behold, sorry, I'm stretching. I was just looking. I look like I have an indentation on my cheek that I never noticed before. It's kind of cool looking. Maybe I'm just tired. Oh, uh, yeah. Okay, so uh, I just saw Critical Mass 17, and he goes, you know, I'll even read it to you because it was better. It sounds even better. It just came out of nowhere, you know. And uh, uh, what did I say to him? Oh, he didn't understand the friend. Uh, he didn't understand the Mark Eden thing. So... Uh, I go, what do you mean, uh, she didn't know who Mark Eden was. I told Mark Eden played basketball, people play, I get it very much. Uh, and uh, he said, uh, he said, I, uh, he asked me, uh, why I sent him the, uh, critical mass today. I said, I only sent it to you when you're a part of it, Gumbo Chef. So he's happy with his, so he now understands Mark Eden, but, uh, uh, and, uh, yeah. I said, I'm only sending the ones that you're a part of. He goes, can't wait to go. I said, okay, Spark, good to know. I got, I got some of them from the critical master himself. And he wrote it out, and I was like, I love that handle. It just looks... So I put it all together, and now I'm the critical master. There it is, folks. Now, I was living out in California for 10 months, and, you know, a lot of things didn't happen. And I have a cousin out there who should go nameless. I'm just going to call him Peglegs. I'm going to call him Peglegs. And I told, I sent him the uh, Romney ad I shot, and he took it. Like, he goes, well, how, how, did you videotape yourself? He goes, I, I want you, I want to videotape it. I go, what do you, you know what, I can't even, it was so much stupidity that I couldn't even, uh, I had no idea what he was talking about. But basically he was uh, asking me, you know, to help him make his own video. And I was like, dude, this was a national commercial that uh, someone shot, and I was the actor in it. And he's always like, you know, he always says some of the dumbest stuff to me. He wants to know how I, uh, I lost weight now. You know, he goes, oh, man, you lost so much muscle mass. And I was like, what do you mean I lost so much muscle mass? It's like, you know, maybe count to ten, think about what you're talking about, and then shut the fuck up. Don't talk to me. Okay? Because, uh, because uh, chicken legs, I like calling them, I'm going to call them chicken legs, chicken legs, whatever you want to call them, chicken legs, uh, just needs to shut the fuck up. You know, so I just, I'm like, you know, he's, uh, he's going on about uh, Obama and saying everybody in New York's voting for Obama, and he says I should worry about the future of our nation. I said, right now I'm just worrying about my own future. Can't worry about the, can't worry about the nation. I'm not, you know, and he's like, God, he's just... This stuff comes out of his mouth. It goes, well, you lost a lot of muscle mass. You look skinnier. Do I look bad? I mean, do I look horrible? I mean, I, I, I'm a little bit of a food coma because Gumbo Chef, I ate the rest of his uh, gumbo, and I put some of my own chicken in it. And uh, I bought the bread that I didn't bring. We didn't have last night for bread for dipping. And, uh, oh, I dipped. I dipped. So I got to shoot tomorrow and Thursday. I teach a class. I was going to go to an audition tomorrow morning, but I feel like I'm going to cut it too close. So uh, I just asked him if I could send in a videotape of it. But he probably knows. So uh, I ain't going to worry about it. You know, you can't go to every audition. And uh, I know I'll just uh, burn the candle at both ends. So uh, I'm just looking at my shirt, underdog. I've had this shirt forever. My friend got it for me. The big H got it for me. I don't see him that much anymore. I notice I don't talk to, you know, a lot of people on, on Facebook, they like stuff I say or some stuff and like that, but, you know, the group uh, has gotten smaller and smaller, the people I actually talk to, so, what are you going to do? What are you going to do? 
So, uh, yeah, yeah, I realize I don't talk to a lot of people. So, uh, but the, the TV show I'm working on tomorrow has called me like 50 times. So I bring, I, they said they have a war, wardrobe truck, but obviously they don't. I have to bring all my own clothes again, so. It's going to be a big dry cleaning bill. And I just think peanut to the vet tomorrow because of her ear, but it's, it's just going to be too tight, so I'm going to take her Friday. And uh, probably be better off anyway. So uh, what else did I want to talk about? i got nothing else to say right now. Uh, stupidity dealing with chicken legs, but always whenever I talk to him, he just I think he just tries to get a charge out of me because no one really is that retarded. And I just closed the window because it was freaking freezing in this bedroom. So uh, I'm actually fading, and it is 8, uh, 8.04. Don't have a television, so I can't watch baseball or football or anything. But that's all changing on Friday, which is a good thing. So, uh, folks, I hope you have a great night. I'm going to sign off now because I'm just going to start babbling about stuff. I just don't know why I'm babbling. But Food Coma has sent in with the gumbo. And uh, I will talk to you later, all right? So Critical Mass did two today. Uh, it might be a lot, but hey, and I want to thank everybody. Thank you. We went over 1,100 views today. And uh, I think over the weekend we were at 1,000. So beautiful. I just want to thank everybody for helping get over 1,100. Okay, and find me Critical Master on Twitter. Uh, and Gumbo Chef, thanks for everything. Love you. Love you so much.